what's happening is, I believe the cell phone is doing to the television what the television did to the radio. People are migrating away from that, and everyone's attention is on the cell phone. And so I kind of compare um, social media channels to television channels, ABC, CBS, NBC, MTV, to some of the social media channels. And for an analogy purposes, some of the context of what you'd see on NBC, the content is gonna be vastly different than an MTV. And so when we're marketing your home on these different channels, we're in, we have a, a very distinctive idea of who we're targeting on each of these channels. But I think what Brandon's really talking about is that the way buyers shop is different. And you need to know that if you're going to be a seller. So, the, and what we're, we've tried to tap into is paying attention to how, how those buyers shop. And I'm really always kind of equate our success with social media with stories that actually have happened via social media. And earlier this year, I had a house that I listed in, in um, Stearns County, um, $750,000 home. And you can list a house anything over 500000 in Stearns County, and you're like, let's hope it sells. <laughs> but, um, but it's beautiful, beautiful land, beautiful outbuildings, and we put it on the market, and we put it on Facebook, and um, this is the way Facebook works, or if, you have, if you're not a, a user of Facebook. If you've looked for homes ever, all of a sudden things will pop up in your newsfeed that are specific to homes. In the same way, if I go on Google and look for flights to Las Vegas, two seconds later or the next day, advertisements for Cosmopolitan Hotel are showing up in my, my newsfeed. That's how it works. It talks to each other. Well, so somebody that was looking at some point at homes all of a sudden has this $750,000 listing in front of them. And these people had me show up and they're like, this is the deal, Heidi. We bought a $200,000 piece of land last year and our building plans are done. We're supposed to be digging in like two months. And their building plans and their lot together were going to be $1 million. And they weren't looking. They weren't going on Roller.com. They weren't going on Trulia. They weren't going on any sites. They were just sitting on the couch downstairs going through their news feed and all of a sudden the house that exactly like the house that they're gonna build shows up in their news feed $250,000 cheaper and they bought the house. And so that's how, I mean, the, and that's a big story. That's a big success story for all the parties involved, but that's where it comes into play where we're tapping into those experiences for people where they didn't know that day and then when they woke up that they were gonna be buying a house that day, but they didn't. If you're searching for a pair of tennis shoes and then all of a sudden wherever you go for the next week those similar tennis shoes show up that's what's called retargeting so some stuff that we're kind of starting to do with and really getting it dialed in we're not there yet but we kind of practice around is um, if people come to our website and they're searching cold spring for instance and we know they're looking at cold spring we then can retarget them our cold spring listings in their newsfeed if they're searching Lakeshore, we can send them Lakeshore, our Lakeshore listing. So we're getting as many eyeballs globally as possible, but then we're also dialing in to who might be the most potential um, buyer or user. This is uh, an example of a drone video that we did at a property that is a good idea. This, I think it's a property in Rice where it, I think it was like a two minute video. What we can do then is we can say, Everybody who's watched that video, we then send in their news feed or wherever more information, more content, maybe interior pictures of that home. So the more we feel that there's engagement, then we can give them more. And so that's one thing that we're, we're um, I believe, on the cutting edge of doing and getting more exposure for our listings.